Montana's football team has a wealth of experience at the offensive line positions, and after adding transfer A.J. Forbes in at center, this O-line is poised to take the next step for this Montana Grizzly offense. Forbes joined the Grizzlies last summer, and in the spring was made the starting center for UM after the graduation of Cy Sermon. I came here because I wanted to be able to, to really compete for a spot, and I, I knew that once I came here, but you know, about a year and a half ago, I knew that I wasn't going to be coming in and be a, start, be a starter right away. I still had to, the work ethic that I've had my whole life, I knew I had to keep that going to be able to earn that spot. And he had some help as Forbes joined an offensive line with a wealth of experience. The Grizz returned starters in right tackle Dylan Cook, right guard Moses Mallory, and left tackle Conlon Beaver, as well as other guys like left guard Cordell Pillians who have starting experience. For a guy like Mallory, he also followed a similar trajectory as Forbes as a transfer who competed for starting minutes right away. I was once the new guy, so I know how it is. You gotta come in, kinda earn your, earn your place but AJ's done a good job of doing that, and he's showing real leadership values. Uh, he's our center, so uh, we listen to whatever calls he makes, and he's doing a good job. I trust him, and I, the rest of the O-line trusts him. The depth doesn't end there on the offensive line with the starters, as players like Colton Kynes, Tyler Ganung, and Skyler Martin also bring a lot of experience to the table and figure to rotate in with Montana's other starters, whether they split first-team reps or work as serviceable backups. The multiple years of experience together goes a long way, as the O line has continued to improve. Oh man, it's amazing. I can look to my left and my right and know I could trust them to make the blocks they need to make as well as uh, they can look at me and trust me to do my assignment. It's very important. So I, I trust them on the field and off the field. That cohesion and trust will continue to grow with this unit as the first game approaches and the Grizzly offense as a whole moves forward. Especially this past, this past week, I don't feel like that we necessarily have any kind of weakness. We're all really strong. We're all athletic. We're all quick. We're all smart. Before I even get up to the line to make a call, I hear Beav and Cookie and Mo and who, you know, whoever else is making calls with me. So we're looking good so far. Reporting in Missoula, Kyle Hanson, MTN Sports.